What's up guys, I have another video here. Um, this is going to show you how you can customize the fonts. Um, it comes with default, I believe, five or six fonts, but you can download more directly from LG. So we're going to go here into the home screen. Nope, I lied. Go back. This one's under display. And then font type. And you can see all the, I've downloaded quite a few. Um, most of the fonts are kind of girly. Okay, I'm not going to lie. They're super girly, but um, a lot of girls really like the fonts, changing fonts all the time. So this is in Korea. Probably a lot of people, girls, are going to get this and customize it just because they like the bigger phones. But I'll show you. If you delete here, these are the ones that I've downloaded. Um, the other ones came pre-installed, so I'll show you guys what those look like, um, the downloaded ones. SJ Secret is one of those. So this is gonna all the menus or or icons are changed. Go back into your home screen. All those are changed. So it changes quite a bit. If you wanna check out like even the fonts here will change. So fonts everywhere are changing so some people really like that option um no root required anything like that and it and it works right out of the box and go back here display again i personally like the smaller fonts but this is too girly too small um we'll go let's do see what maximum looks like for, for some of those uh, people that are blind um and this will warn you that some apps won't display it correctly, etc., which is normal because not all have the capability of displaying the, the fonts. As you can see up here on the clock, it seems really small, and then others are really large. So that's something to consider when you're ch changing fonts, selecting a font, what you like. Uh, we're going to go, let's go back into display. And like the themes, you can select to get more directly from LG Smart World and you'll have a, just a list of all the fonts that you can get. Um, all of them are free. I haven't seen any paid content really for customization so that's a plus but it would be cool if you can install your own just because I've converted tons and tons of fonts from the Samsung Galaxy S2 and beyond so um, there's some that I really like that aren't available. And so let's go back. And here are the fonts in large already selected. So that's just a quick video showing you guys the fonts, customization, what changes with them. Some people are going to really like that just because it changes on the phone, etc. But um, like I said, if you guys like more little mini series like this, let me know. And I'll do like different features, different things included with the phone. Until next time, guys. Peace out.